On Saturday, May 4th, Fish Trap Lake is inviting the community to join them for their spring cleanup. Volunteers will be picking up trash in and around the lake in an effort to keep Pike County clean for everyone to enjoy. Gloves, garbage bags, and other materials will be provided for those who register to help. Yeah, so in years past, Fish Trap has had a really big spring cleanup, and when COVID happened, that kind of dropped off. Uh, so we're wanting to restart that and make it a bigger event than what it has been. And so we ask for volunteers just to come out and be with us, spend the day with us, and help us out as much as they can. We understand that it can be tough to get out and volunteer for stuff like this. But we love our lake and we love our community, and so we want to do the best that we can to keep it clean and to make it welcoming for everyone in the community. Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. If trash stays in the lake, it will eventually be flushed out elsewhere. A trash hunter vessel will be deployed to gather garbage in the middle of the water. We will actually have our trash hunter vessel, which is a vessel that has the capability to bring trash into it. And so our contractors will be running that vessel for us that day. Uh, if anyone in the public is interested in bringing their own personal boat, you're more than welcome to. And then other than that, people that show up can just on foot, walk around the shoreline, pick up trash or anywhere on the grounds that they would like it always goes somewhere else. So if we can keep this area as clean as we can, then it'll only benefit things on down the river. It'll eventually get flushed down to Pikeville. Um, that is where the water that we release goes to. And so by keeping it clean up here, we try to lessen the things that end up down there, but also to just keep our grounds clean. We want our grounds to be clean and to be available to the public and be as beautiful as they can be. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.